News Now. Kills is in big car chase from polling station in Nakuru. Low turnout in Mombasa, Kakamega gubernatorial polls. It wasn't me, Oparanya down plays alleged support for Malala. With Teddy Otieno. Good morning. Chaos erupted at Kiamuni Secondary School polling station in Nakuru. The incident saw Nakuru Town East MP elect David Gikaria chased away by angry voters. Gikaria, who is a new DA agent for the Rongai parliamentary election, arrived at a polling station only to be blocked by a section of voters. <laughs> Minol incumbent MP Raymond Moy is called on IBC to ensure free and fair exercise. Depends on IBC to be able to conduct a free and fair election, and I hope it will be like that. You know, you hear a lot of things. You hear that ballot boxes has been stuffed, and I think this issue where uh, elected members are all over Rongai, I think it is not fair because the playing field is not level. They are out there to attempt to intimidate voters from Rongai that their parties may take the day. I believe at the end of the day, I'm the winner. I believe Raymond will prevail today. As a mere candidate in the Kakamega gubernatorial elections has urged locals to turn out in large numbers, decrying a low voter turnout, Baraza accused his main opponent, Cleophus Malala, of voter bribery. Jambo tu ambalo tumeona kwa wingi sana ni mambo ya voter bribery. Uh, Mpizani wangu ambaye ni Cleophus Malala amekuwa akinunua wapiga kura wengi sana kwa vituo mbalimbali. Nimetembea hapa Matungu almost all the polling stations. Uh, there is a lot of voter bribery which in my uh, considered opinion hiyo ni an election offense and I want to urge IBC na all the security agencies to make sure they take action. The low voter turnout is typical of a by election. Uh, this is more or less like a by election and usually when you have a by election uh, we don't have a very large voter turnout and that's why I'm taking this opportunity to urge all the supporters of my supporters uh, to come up in large numbers so that they can actually vote. Still in Kakamega, Governor Wickliffe for Paranya is urged resume of supporters in the county to ignore post during rounds online showing that he's backing Cleophas Malala in the race. The ODM deputy party leader father claimed that his Facebook page was hacked, adding that the matter is now with the DCI. Oparanya dispelled the post as an act of hacking by agents of doom, adding that he is fully behind Fernandez Baraza. In a post shared on Oparanya's page earlier today, Malala's photo was shared complete with the hashtag Vote Cleofas Wakongo Malala. And finally in Mombasa, gubernatorial candidate Abdul Swamad Nasir is urged his supporters to turn out and vote. Nasser cast his ballot at Mvita Primary School polling station, even as they decried the low voter turnout. Voter turnout for us is extremely low. Kituo hiki chahapa, we so far have less than 10% uh, of the voter turnout. Like in Sistizatena, um, we need people who are able to kwa wingi. Watu watu wame wamechoshwa kisha pia ile election iliyopita uh, vile kulikuwa kuna mishaps nyingi uh, vituo vingine vilichelewa kufunguliwa These and more stories at 11 I'm Teddy Otieno good morning The Hot 96 News